Oh. That's not a lady, love. That's not a lady. That's a man. So can you tell us That's what a fucking man. They said that you beat her, took her phone, took her wig. I didn't do anything. The whole time. So was this young lady? I'm another motherfucking bitch. So, he was getting hit from another bitch, which is the other nigga. What? The whole time that we was on motherfucking live. So with that being said, I <laughs> pulled up and beat his ass. And I beat her so ass you and, and I slapped the fuck out of Larry too. At this point. She came out the motherfucking dough. She came out the dough. Looking like she ready to fight. Like she walking over, she walking over like she ready to fight. So I got a call. So like, Shamar, now, about to get at the have you stopped the bitch take our run before? I didn't saw, I ain't even seen this, this man before. All I know uh -huh. was, all I know was that Larry was downtown or whatever. And I asked him, I said, Larry, what you doing downtown? And he, he was like, he was trying to see me or whatever, right? But the whole motherfucking time, he ended up leaving for my friend Ty. And go, hey, motherfucker, what's that? So, really, reality, you were, you was trapping or you, whatever you were doing, you were making your money and shit. But at the same time, you brought this bitch to your house where you could at least just call me. And say, oh, babe, can you come over here? Or, um, you know, mm. when I was out, when I was outside, what would you? You're not helping. You're not helping me do anything. So, it's well, like, I did see the girl running. Like, I don't she know. Was running. And how did her wig get off her head? Did you snatch her wig off of it? Cause I saw her running with a wig. I saw her running with her wig in her hand. Huh? So Larry was cheating yeah. on you with this girl at his house. Yeah. You know what? It. You know what? You're gonna have to leave yeah. Larry alone. I'm gonna tell you right now, Shamar, because that girl. You know, I don't know her. But you know, I just know you're gonna have to leave Larry alone because you a queen and you cannot be out here fighting these little slut buckets. I'm not scared. I'm not, baby, I'm not mad that I can't stay with Larry. If I wanted to stay with him, I could have. Well, she was Larry's Larry house anyway, so. around with other women. And you you can't have that. He'll be the best guy to have you put in jail. Let me tell y'all something. Larry is Larry is at the the crackhead ass hoe toy house. Oh, so they wow. at the crackhead ass house. Okay. That ain't even Larry oh. house. That's his wow. ex house. Mm. Well, how did you get over the top took you over there? No. Oh. His brother well, his brother pulled up with me. Since last night. Have you talked to Larry? The brother Shuma, you gonna have to Larry out. Because you can't be out here huh? fighting over these nothing ass women for Larry. Larry be the guy you put in jail. You're going to have to cut Larry off. I mean, that's just too much.
You know, a purse can only take so much. And then when you go out and do your thing, he be ready to fight you. Ooh. You yes. know, I just don't want to see you go to jail because you know, last for the show. It's just like, I don't know, but then again, it's like, yeah, you love me or whatever, but you live my nerves you like, yeah, love my you if he's sitting around let other women suck on him, but you know, he, he can't got love just, you, Shamar. Look at what he's doing. He's know. displaying. You know, because he, he got other women he's sleeping he around with behind your back. You don't he need can't. that. That is bad energy. You know, because, see, that's so disrespectful. You know, and he know how you feel about him. And then that's the thanks that you get. No, you don't have to let him go. You're going to have to let him go. That is so disrespectful. You know. Look, Shema, I'm they saying the Wi Fi is messing up. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna hang up and we're gonna come right back home. Okay.